evict only. Chingwe, how are you doing? Oh, um, you did have a lot to say when this fight happened with Zion. If you talked a lot about how you have sponsored Zion to this show, you know, you are the reason why he's here. He even needs this show more than you. So I just want to find out, it looks like from your statement, you were giving everything. Is there anything in it for you from him? I mean, I have a beautiful relationship with Zion. But it didn't I'll sound that way. Me. Next pair to be evicted is Ndine. Eh, hey, now the show just started. Ebuka the table shaker. Thank you. Because we'll be talking pro 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 anyhow. Now Ebuka don't they ask questions. People don't they don't they, they don't they lose guard. They cannot talk again. Ebuka started by asking me. You mentioned something about Chingwe. When Chingwe and Zion were having their issues, he said, eh, you don't even need to know, you know anything going on about the whole fight that is obvious is going to be Chingwe's fault anyways and Ebuka asked why did you make that statement why do you think Chingwe is at fault baby girl said she did not remember <laughs> I'm like well, how will you remember before the main Ogbonga <laughs> gist for me is Chingwe and Zion if you watch this week you know how Chingwe has been when they had their fight Baby girl said all manner of things. How she sponsored their coming to the show. How she did this. How she did that. How Zion convinced her to come. She had businesses. She did not want to come. But Zion convinced her to come. But oh um, more. Now Ebuka asked. After all these things. Like you said all these things. Does it mean you don't have anything to gain from the relationship? Baby girl and I said no I, I have a beautiful relationship and i literally held zion's hand to come he did not want to be here blah 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 i'm like really chingwe you held zion's hand hey <laughs> no but you talk say now zion like convinced you to come i was just looking at zion zion was so embarrassed Chingwe that was like, her mouth was just running, bro, 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 bro. All of a sudden, cannot even put <laughs> words together. Did you guys just hear Chingwe saying that she literally held uh, Zion's hand? Like, she was the one that convinced Zion to come. It must be nice. <laughs> what Ebuka can do? <laughs> the fear of Ebuka is the beginning of wisdom. Oh my day, uh, our Delulu auntie. Ruthie, Ebuka said, Ruthie, you are that girl that said you are not scared of anybody. You are very outspoken. You tell people you do your mind. But there is something you said about Wani. You said Wani is rude. She is stingy. The whole thing, you said the whole thing Wani accused Onyeka of when they had their fight. That is exactly what, who Wani is. Why didn't you tell her to her face? And the girl said, eh, I said it to her face. I am not scared of anybody. De -de 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 -de. I'm like, eh? Ruthie, Ruthie. <laughs> it's funny how this Ruthie always speaks a fight with somebody that is not even fighting her. Like, the way she fights imaginary fights in her head is really alarming. It was so funny, eh? Wani just looked at her and laughed because it's even laughable. Is really really laughable. Moving on, guys. Victoria, we know that Victoria has just been so dull, like the mood swing is just too much. And Ebuka finally asked her question: This whole thing going on with you, is it in any way related to Sean? And she said, No, it has nothing to do with Sean. Do you not think your relationship with Sean is off as a pair? She said, No. I'm like, Hey, then what is your problem? She said uh, the house has been somehow Zingwe re, uh, relationship fight really affected her and she felt like going home. Like she was just saying a whole bunch of stuff. I'm like, girl, just find a way to sit up. If not, you will be out and it will be very unfair to Sean. This is a warning from Ebuka. If you like, take it. If you like, don't take it. Moving on, guys. The main eviction process. The bottom four for this week are as follows. The Radicals, Ndine, Zinwe, 
and flourish guys hey <laughs> did any of this button for shock you i'm not shocked at all i only pity the radicals because it's been an hectic week from last week to this week being up back to back ha huh, is a lot okay but i am not surprised big brother called the custodians they opened the custodian box and what they got out of it is evict only hey lo and behold big brother had to call them to the diary room they made their deliberation and they decided they chose undine i'm like it's obvious like it's obvious you could tell like they had the least connection with them and also they were the custodian holder last week okay so it would be fair for another person to be saved so guys undine has been evicted i see that coming like it was obvious Whew. all the best to them it's obvious they are very competitive they won the first custodian challenge the first female HOH from the season. Like, they've done their part. They've showcased themselves. All the best to them. All the very, very best to them. When Ebuka asks, you know, Ndine, who are you going to miss? And Chini says she's going to miss Onye Kadimo. I'm like, okay, I'm shocked though. Are you even close to Onye Ka like that? The people we are, you were so close to, which is them, but the way twins, we did not even mention them. But <laughs> this this game, it is what it is, Sha. <laughs> and finally, guys, we have our bottom four as how viewers voted. Radicals was the very first. We have Undine followed by Zingwe, then Flourish. Flourish had the least vote. <laughs> Ruti should go and thank our God for entering that ship with me because it obviously worked in our favor. If not, with this whole bottom four and being the least voted for, <laughs> they will be out by now. But the relationship is obviously working for her. So guys, what do you think about this whole eviction process? The radicals, hey, they, oh yeah, they, they are here though. They've been saved twice. They were up last week. They were saved. This week also, they've been saved. Ha, huh. that must be nice. Oh yeah, they, they are ahead. Whoever is praying for them in the village should pray harder. <laughs> so guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed watching.